the account. And while he is one of the wealthiest presidential candidates we've ever seen, he's also given more to charity than anybody else, both as a dollar amount and also as a percentage of his income. Now, Romney is trying to put his tax returns behind him tonight because Newt Gingrich has moved ahead of him in the polls. And today, Fox 13 political editor Craig Patrick talked with both candidates one-on-one. -on -one. And, Craig, we're going to start with Newt Gingrich. What is his strategy, strategy, strategy rather, excuse me, in Florida now? Well, so far, he's bearing down right here on the I-4 corridor. He said he would be interested in reviving high-speed rail if he got buy-in in Tallahassee. And when I asked him about potential running mates, he gave two names from Florida. You have said that no Republican can win the White House without winning Florida. So with that in mind, would you seriously consider Governor Scott as a potential running mate? I think he's a serious possibility, just as I think... Uh that uh, your Senator uh, Marco Rubio is a serious possibility. You have been a strong proponent of high-speed rail, particularly in Florida. You've said that it is viable, that it can and should be done. If you are elected president, what will you do to fast-track high-speed rail? How can you get it done? Well, I'd, I'd want to see that it was done in the private sector, and I would want to see it was done with matching venture capital. So you had somebody who had an, an interest in getting it efficient and getting it profitable. And would you offer federal grants, as the president I tried think, to do? I think that would be part of, of looking at it if it was done in a private sector manner, where in the long run it was going to be operating uh, in, a, in an efficient way and in a way that broke even. I wouldn't want to get us to get into the Amtrak kind of situation, where you are permanently subsidizing uh, a system that, that never comes close to breaking even. State leaders are currently considering.